Hello guys and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I am going to be showing you what is in my pencil cases. This case is the one that I bring to school with me every day, or to university I should say, and this one just stays at home but has the stuff that I use the most frequently in it. So without further ado, let's just get straight into it. So since this is my most essential pencil case, we're gonna start off with this one. So this is just a Muji pencil case. I think it's the biggest one in the kind of just one compartment. So I'm just gonna go through what is in it. And the first thing is this little like screen cleaner thingy bob because I like to keep my phone screen clean. Then I just have a random rubber. I think I got it from WH Smith last year. Then I have four of the Stedler Tri Plus Fineliners. These are just in the colors that I use for my modules because I do like to color code them and make sure that everything is looking as cohesive as possible. This is a Muji 0.5 mechanical pencil and I'm really enjoying this, especially because I am doing management accounting as a module this year and there's a lot of numbers to be filling out so it's kind of the same reason that you would use a pencil for maths. Then we have my Lummy Safari, is that what they're called? Uh, it's in a medium, medium nib and I just really like it. I have the black just Lummy ink in it and I really like it. It's way too thick to use in my bullet journal but I use it for practically everything else. Then we have just a Muji ruler that is looking absolute shit because it is so dirty so I really need to clean this off. And then we have this which is a stylus. It's from the Friendly Swede and it's one of these like disc styluses, if you can see that. It's really precise and it's really nice for writing on your devices. I'm currently using it on just my phone and it's working out really well. Also, I forgot to mention that I have my Muji open 38 gel pen which I use for literally everything but that is currently keeping my bullet journal closed so that's not in my pencil case just for that reason. Sorry for my voice by the way my throat is so tickly and so sore and I'm coughing all the time so that's why I sound probably very strange. So this is not really a pencil case it's an H&M like travel bag but I really like it for my pencil case because I can at a glance kind of see what is in it. So as I said, this is the one I keep at home. And first of all, I have some tip eggs because who doesn't need tip eggs at every point in their life, right? Then I ha have this ACAEW kind of highlighter thingy, which we got uh, when we went to an event. And it's just kind of a star highlighter with one color highlight on each side. Then I have my favorite sticky notes. It's just these blue, I think they're from Poundland possibly and I really like them just for anything that I need to jot down. I have some washi tape from Ally Express. I'll link it down below and it's a really nice like wintery scene so I really like it. Then we have my Lamy kind of refill cartridges, another ruler, a uh, Stedler Tri Plus Fine Liner in dark grey, Muji 0.7 gel pen, Platinum Preppy in extra fine, three of the Zebra Mild Liners, this random pen, my old mechanical pencil, refills for my old mechanical pencil, refills for my new mechanical pencil, and another one of those, Stedler Tri Plus Fine Liner in light grey. I have so many Muji pens in here, this is unreal, okay. The rest of my Muji pens in 0.38 and 0.7. This Unipen fine line, which I really like for kind of bolder lines. And finally, just this random, you know, no brand pen, which is really, really tiny, which make it super handy if I just need a pen to throw in my handbag. And that is everything that are in my pencil cases. I hope you have enjoyed this video. And if you want to see anything else, like, I don't know, what's in my school bag, possibly, anything like that, just leave it in the comments down below and I will get right to it because I really enjoy kind of filming things that I know you guys want to see. Stay up to date with my videos, make sure you click the subscribe button so that they'll pop right into your subscription box every Wednesday and Saturday. I'd also appreciate it if you gave this video a thumbs up if you liked it, so I know, and I'm always happy to talk to you guys in the comments. As usual, all my social media will be linked down below and you can find me there until Saturday. I will see you then, bye bye.